Hello everyone, I am Dattatra Nikam. Welcome you all on our channel eFanda for new day, new topic. And our today's topic is understanding of register color code part 24B. As mentioned, this videos will be presented in a series and we have already created a separate playlist for electrical discipline or electrical engineering. And if you are new to our channel then please visit to our channel eFunda and watch all the videos created really the various topics for which the separate playlists are already created and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press bell icon to get the latest notification and upload of our new video on our channel eFunda also eFunda team has created membership option please press the join button to get the membership and get the advantage of all the membership benefit where you can get the video notification first to you. So let's begin with our today's topic that is understanding of a register color code part 24B. Introduction to resistors. A resistor is an electrical component that limits or regulates the flow of electrical current in an electronic circuit. Resistors can also be used to provide a specific voltage for an active device such as a transistor. In electronic circuit, the resistors are used to reduce current flow, adjust signal levels to divide voltages, bias active elements and terminate transmission line among other uses. Resistors are usually very thinny and it is challenging to print resistance value on them. So color bands are printed on them to represent the electrical resistance. These color bands are also known as register color codes. As you can see in the symbol, the symbol of a register is shown in a zigzag line whereas the actual register is also shown into the picture. Then there are some questions arise. Why and what are the color code registers are used? By the nature of generating heat, when the conducting current resistors are used in a heater, toaster, microwave, electric stove and many more heating appliances. Mainly in a light bulb, the metal filament glows white hot due to very high temperature produced from the resistance when the electricity is passed through it. Then the curious question is why the symbol of a resistor is a zigzag. A basic resistor is usually a length of a nichrome wire wound around a ceramic tube. From the side view, it appear as a zigzag line, which is why a register is a zigzag symbol. For a fixed value, the rheostat and the pot, the one left which is shown as a zigzag line is an American symbol and the one shown on the right hand side is the international one. This is how the registers are defined. Similarly, one can refer the picture for which we have already discussed about the color code. We will see the brief actual details will be seen during the progression of our videos. Thanks to courtesy of the circuittoday.com from where we have used the sketch where various color codes are shown and some gaps are defined. We will see the significance first digit, second digit, third digit. 4 is the decimal multiplier, then the next one is the tolerance after the gap and the last one is the temperature coefficient. This is how the structure of the register is defined internationally so that it will remain same everywhere across the globe wherever the registers are being used and it will be uniform in understanding and selection. Further moving on to types of register, one can refer to the picture 
where the type of registers are defined thanks to electronic clinic where they have compiled all the register type together register are further divided into the linear register and a non linear register now we will see the further category a linear register is one of the most commonly used register and the resistance of the linear resistance remain constant no matter if the potential difference or the voltage applied is increase or decrease similarly a linear register has a fixed resistance which does not change a linear resistance has a further two types have their linear properties and the measure t of the resistance or a resistor used in the electronic circuit are of the fixed type resistor and the fixed type resistor are the type of resistor in which has the fixed resistance values and mostly the fixed resistor values are being used are a standard ranges of 1 kilo ohm 100 ohm 10 kilo ohm and 330 ohm further the fixed resistors are divided into carbon composition resistor wire wound resistor thick film resistor thin film resistor further the thick film resistor are further divided into fusible resistor ceramic film resistor metal oxide and then further thin film resistor is further divided into carbon film resistor and a metal film resistor similarly the other type is the variable resistor where this type of resistors in which the resistance can be changed manually by rotating the knob of the variable resistor one can see into the picture and this type of resistors are used to set the reference voltages and there are also used in tuning circuit this variable resistors are used with the microcontrollers analog pins and this resistors mostly have a three legs one can see into the picture as well where the rightmost and the leftmost legs of the variable resistor are connected with the voltage and the ground type now moving on to further type of the non linear type a non linear resistors are those type of resistors in which the flow of a current changes with change in the temperature or applied voltage to that particular type of resistance the further types are thermistor ldr variester resistor and a flexible resistor the most commonly used is the thermistor thermistor is also a type of resistor in which the current flowing through a resistor changes with change into the temperature similarly the photoresistor or a photoconductive cell that is ldr type is a type of resistor in which the current flow changes with the amount of light following the devices and this is a variable resistor and the resistance changes with the amount of light falling on the sensor you can see the construction and their type further the variester resistor and a flexible resistors are not commonly being used as the most popular is the thermistor type so this is how the type of resistors are categorized and we have seen the detail further we will see the significance of resistor their color code and their implementation how do resistor work one can refer to the picture where you can see how the wire is connected to the resistor and thanks to courtesy of a 42 electronics.com where they have represented very nicely that many cars are coming from one end and then further at the resistor level it is a single road where only one car can pass and then further again it can be go into the three lanes this is how the resistors are the positive electronic component that controls the voltage level and limit the current flow into the circuit they also operate based on the ohms law with their resistance measured in ohm and can be made from various material each with pros and cons when these resistors are connected into the circuit then resistor convert some electrical energy into heat 
managing the voltage and preventing damage to the components used into the circuit as they have used in as a current limiting voltage division timing operator and signaling filtering additionally resistors are typically marked with a color band to increase their resistance values and the tolerance one can refer to the another picture where one can see the details of their bands and their significance their digits you can see digit first digit second digit third and the number of zeros then the tolerances for example if you can so look at into the below where digits are defined with a different color code as well as the tolerances are given that 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 are the digit and the tolerances are silver is a plus minus 10% gold is a plus minus 5% brown is a plus minus 1% green is a 0.5% then purple is plus minus 0.1% this is how for example we can take first picture where 4 7 0 3 are the values that means 470 into the number of zeros that is a three zeros then that means the value become 470 kilo ohm and into the second picture one can see the color as a 6 82 that is 68 and then two digits of the zeros that is 6.8 kilo ohm this is how the resistance color code can be read and further it can be implemented to decide what is the final value of that particular type of a register offered with a different color code and suitably can be used into the circuit we have come to our topic that is understanding register color code one can refer to the first picture where you can see the register and their band significance first digit is a brown second digit is a black third digit is the multiplier that is a red color and the last band is for the tolerance that is a gold we will see the details one can refer to the another picture where you can see the six band register category is shown as we have already seen that first digit then second digit of the second color then third digit and then further fifth digit will be fourth digit will be the multiplier then fifth is the tolerance and sixth is the temperature coefficient now one can see the color codes are here colors defined for each digits are black color brown red orange yellow green blue violet gray white gold and silver for easy remember there is a method which we have learned during our student days during our engineering days are bb roy great britain got a very good wife these are the first letter of each color code defined in the second picture and you can see the six band register value here 2 7 4 and then multiplier and then tolerance and the temperature that means it is 274 ohm plus minus 2% and 250 ppm per k is the temperature coefficient similarly one can see below four band where the four bands are shown three color code and then the last is the multiplier now you can see four band that is a brown red then green are the shown and then the value becomes 1 2 into 10 raised to 5 that is a 1200 kilo ohm plus minus 5% tolerance then for 5 band you can see the various colors are given here and those colors are first is the 100 into 10 raised to power of 2 because the red color is there at the value and then plus minus 1% that is a brown color so this value becomes 10000 ohm plus minus 1% this is how the color code are being read during the implementation and these are the method 
are employed for identification purpose as it's very easy to remember the color code at least you can have some technique to remember and it will easy to help you to identify which type of a register is there that means in terms of the value not in terms of the type of the register so this is how we have tried to cover the topic of understanding of a register color code and this is the most critical topic in electrical as electrical engineering requires color coding and this is one of the important topic which we have covered as part of electrical engineering hope you will get this topic and it will help you to understand the electrical engineering topic more detail keep watching and follow our electrical engineering list along with our other playlist which are also benefited for you with this we are concluding on our today's topic thanks for watching our channel e funda where you will get to know the fundamentals so that is our tagline get your fundamentals right where we do identify the needs then we evaluate the need then define plan for a particular need and then accordingly execute the plan this is what we are creating our technical videos so that it will help every individual to get their fundamentals right and if you are new to our channel then subscribe to our channel and don't forget to press bell icon to get the latest notification on upload of our new video on our channel e funda also you can follow us on our instagram page and do follow our facebook page as well so keep watching our channel e funda for new day new topic